Welcome back to another episode. Today I'm going to fill my muffler with bubble solution. Here we have the drag radial gecko in its natural habitat. Let me see if I can get a zoom in. His defense mechanism is being the same color as a Nitto 555R. I'll give you some updates. I'm, uh, as you can see, I'm putting my RPF ones on my EJ8 because I've kind of been thinking this is going to be the the show car and this is going to be the go car. So I'm going to put the 16s on this one, get the light 15s, the light SI wheels on the four door. And um, honestly, these drag riddles, they're too tall. I think I made a mistake by going with these uh, 245, 50, two, yeah, 245, 50, 16. They're like 25, 25 and a half inches tall. Um, so I think I'm going to stick some like Toyos on the 15 inch wheels, some like uh the uh, R888s or something like that. I'm gonna just go a different route. I think I screwed up again this tall tire. Um, but yeah, if you're in the Houston area to buy some really cheap Nitto drag radials, um, these are gonna be for sale. So what else did I do? Oh, I swapped the uh, the carbon dipped valve cover onto this guy because, like I was saying, oh my god. Yeah, this is gonna be more of the show. So it already had the carbon fiber intake. So now it's got the carbon fiber valve cover. Well, it's dipped. Intake is real carbon fiber. Um, I'm trying to, I, I think I'm gonna do like a carbon fiber theme. I, I wanna change out the filter for a green filter and just kinda do like a aluminum, like a polished and carbon fiber and green accent theme. Um, that one it could just be ugly as long as it's fast. Um, okay, so. If you've been on my channel since uh, the beginning, I filled up the muffler of this car with bubbles and it worked. It worked like amazingly well. I was very surprised with how good it worked. But uh, before I had the hood exit done on this car, I went ahead and bought like an eBay uh, cat back. So what I'm gonna do is, right, this, this exhaust is just hanging here. It's just for basically for looks right now. So I'm gonna take the axle, it's like gonna be like an axle back. I guess it goes right over the lower control arm. From here back, I'm gonna go ahead and put this exhaust onto the EJ8. Uh, Cause I really like it, I mean I went, I was kind of looking around extensively on eBay and it's got the smaller tip. It's not the uh, four, four and a half inch. I think this is only like three and a half maybe. So it's not so obnoxious and it's, it, it tucks up pretty nice. And I just, uh, yeah, I just, it's, you know, it's free and it's, I'm not doing anything with it. So I'm gonna go ahead and put it on the EJ8. EJ8, it's a mouthful. Um, okay, but yeah, let's, uh, before I get that, <laughs> Before I get that muffler swapped over here, I'm gonna go ahead and fill this guy up with bubbles and see if I can uh, put on the show for you guys. There you should do it. Just in case you wanted to know how much uh, Super Miracle bubbles you need to fill up your muffler, it's about two and a half bottles. Uh, be sure to change out your bubble fluid every 3,000 miles. All right, I've got my Super Miracle Bubbles. I've got my funnel. I've already drained the exhaust fluid, so now it's time to uh, top it off with some new uh, exhaust fluid. All right. It's uh, one down. Oh, hey, uh, no, I'm just, I'm just uh, cleaning out my muffler. <laughs> fucking neighbors All right exhaust fluid is probably a uh, exhaust fluid should be nice and topped off Let's go ahead and uh, crank it up and 
see what it does. But first I need to get a, make sure I have a good, good camera angle. I may have overfilled my uh, exhaust fluid. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> there you go, I'm starting to blow bubbles. <laughs> there we go, now we're getting a good amount of bubbles. <laughs> oh, you can see all the bubbles just draining out of the, the, the front of the muffler. It has like a little drain hole to stop water from uh, you know being retained and rusting out the muffler. So all the, the solution is just running out, just dripping off that little drain hole right there. But I, at least I got some bubbles. It was uh, My first attempt at this was a lot better actually. All right, now that I'm done with all the shenanigans, uh, so I gotta run to my brother's house and get my impact to uh, take these wheels off, cause I need to get I've got some like brand new tires that I, you know, I probably have like a couple hundred miles on them. I'm gonna get these tires mounted up on the RPF ones, get those suckers on the front of the two door. But I did have to lower the back because I want the tire just tucking and the front, I'm probably gonna have to lower the front as well after I get the uh, 16s on there. Got the wheel switched out in the front and I'm pretty happy with the height. It's a little low, it was rubbing in the parking lot. I might have to raise it up a bit because I got it tucking like half an inch front and back. But um, yeah, I might have to go up like half an inch and it's just too low. But man, I love the way it looks. Maybe if I cambered it a little bit, I can get away with how low it is because I really like the way it looks. Man, these wheels look good on like anything, just about. It's a good uh, photo opportunity right here. Thumbnail. All right guys, that's just about it. Um, tonight is the giveaway for the uh, turbo gasket set. And I already have something in mind for my next giveaway. Um, but I like to wait a little bit, kind of space it out. Maybe I'll do it, uh, not this, sir, what's today? Thursday. Yeah, maybe I'll do it next weekend. The, everyone that did enter the giveaway, uh, good luck. Uh, I'm gonna try and do it around six o'clock, hopefully. So I need to hurry up and, uh, what I like to do is assign a number to all the names that entered. And then I like, you know, go to the random.org and have a uh, number randomly generated. And that's gonna be the winner of the, uh, of the free giveaway. So, uh, yeah, that's coming up tonight. If you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching.